This is a 2009 Dodge Journey, a 3.5. Friend dropped it off last night for me to work on. It's in need of a oil change, but there's a nasty tick in the engine at times. Sometimes comes and goes. The car has 78,600 miles, and I suspect that what might be going on is sludge buildup in the oil galleys and oil lines. If you take, sometimes when you use low quality oil over time, you can get a sludge buildup. And I suspect that with the mileage that this car has, that very well could be the problem. So we're gonna do a engine flush along with an oil change. We're gonna put a higher quality oil in it. It's Amsoil XL 10W30. And uh, we'll see if that helps. But um, we'll start the motor up here in a second. Get this thing going. The ticking noise is not there now, but when you first start it, when you do a cold start, it seems to be at its worst, and a certain amount of ticking at cold startup is normal, but this vehicle sometimes hangs on, which leads me to believe that uh, there, there could be some sludge buildup. So we'll see. So again, we're dealing with a two things. One is in need of an oil change, and the other is this ticking sound, which is especially prevalent at engine startup. And unfortunately, some of this ticking is normal. My 2017 Challenger has a tick when it first starts up, but as soon as the oil gets flowing, it disappears. This sometimes disappears on this Dodge Journey, and sometimes it, it doesn't. This is the product we're gonna put in this thing. It's an Amsoil engine flush. I've been using it for years. Go ahead and dump it in. And we're gonna start the motor and run it for 30 minutes. I went ahead and put it up on the stands because I don't wanna run the engine up on the stands with this stuff in it. This is only to be used at engine idle. So the instructions call for 15 to 20 minute idle with the engine flush. I get an extra five minutes. And then the next thing we do is drain this oil immediately. Here's the oil we're going to use. It's called Amsoil XL 10W30. It's good for one year for 12,000 miles.
This is a Wix XP, part number 57060XP. I use the XP because our intention is to go with a year, one year oil change. This oil is good for 12,000 miles or one year. Don't over torque these bolts, the plugs. I know too many guys are, are doing that. And if you're unsure, look at the torque spec. It's so much easier than screwing up that thread in there. I like these little spouts right here. You can buy them for a buck at Amsoil. I'm gonna check the dipstick real quick. Go ahead and start it so you can hear what I'm what I think I'm hearing. I started it to back it off the ramps and it uh, sounded better than it ever has. So I think we might be on to something here. We'll go ahead and fire it up. Yeah, it sounds pretty good. I guess we'll we'll know in time whether we've really solved it or not, but I think we may have done some improvement here. Time will tell. So that's about it for now. You guys take care.